Today I want to talk about success and failure. Okay. What's your definition of success? I would think feel like success is doing what you want to do, but being at the top of it. Vanessa's been thinking about returning to gymnastics and pursuing a career in dance. To make that goal possible, I want her to redefine success. In the past, success has been attaining the gold and being on top, but that's taken all the fun out of the process. So today is a day for you to practice finding success. Here's your assignment. Vanessa, you will be going to Albano's Brooklyn Pizzeria. Once there, you will have a few tasks. Number one, toss and make a few pizzas. Number two, attract business through passing out free samples of the pizza you have made to people on the street. And make sure to ask people for their opinions on your pizza. <laughs> oh, Lord. What do you think of it? Well, I think it's good because I'm going to have to find successes out of things I'm not good at. So. Yes! Yeah! <laughs> Got it! <laughs> Welcome to Albano's Brooklyn Pizza. Thank you. I'm Anthony Albano. Hi, Anthony. Pleasure. Very nice to meet you. So I'm Vanessa. I understand you want to learn how to make pizza. Definitely, definitely. I'm very excited. You came to the right place, okay, darling. Okay, good. Get you to okay. you want 20 inches. Impressive. All right. This oven has made over 10,000 pizzas in the last seven years. Wow. You see the way he did? Don't be afraid. You don't have to do okay. that. That kill. Okay, put it down. All right, now, Should I do that thing? Yeah, gently. Like, give it like a, like you're going to circle it. Oops. Okay. <laughs> okay. Now what you do is you take it out. Okay. okay. And what you're going to do is gently, as you go, see, hold your hand like a lock. Okay. Don't get nervous. Yeah, that's it. Come on, you jump 30 <laughs> feet in the air. You were flipping upside everything. That's right. <laughs> okay. Nice job. All right, now. Okay. Get it. Oh, no, no, sorry. That's all right. That's all right. We'll help you out here. I'm not a pizza maker you know i don't know what the hell i'm doing so so just accept that and, and just have fun with it nice all right now get okay. your cheese that's it oh use both pans you gotta get you gotta be italian you gotta put it in there okay pick it up oh okay flip 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 well done Yay. Nice. I did it. all right you're a little but we'll get you work it out a little bit at a time <laughs> okay all right okay there's your pizza that you made. Okay. Look what you did. That wasn't my pizza. For, yet, would I lie to you? Come on. <laughs> you want to uh, go out and try giving some samples? Okay. It's a little hot now. Okay. This is real pizza. Are you kidding me? You got to go. You got to travel 3,000 miles to get this pizza. <laughs> Lovely. Hi. Would you like I to would... try some pizza? Is it good? Oh, oh, come oh, on, baby. It's from Brooklyn, baby. Oh, it's there real deal. Come, come on. Oh, 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 oh. Careful. Careful. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. Off, I guess, but yeah, oh, you know, that's good. That's, that's good. That's the best part. Thanks. Yeah, no. Let us know and be honest. You know, we want to. We want the honest truth. That's right. How's it taste? It's good. Oh, I right. might get a little crispier, but a little okay. Crispy. So okay. next time, but the sauce yeah. is on the money the and the, the cheese. The sauce and the cheese are good. Crispy crust. Good. Thank you, oh, yeah. Thank you right. very much. Thank you, I definitely learned to take pride today in the small things, in the small successes. Making pizza may not be the greatest thing in the world, but it was great for me because it was something that I learned that was new. And if I ever do decide to go back into gymnastics, you know, I don't have to be the number one in the United States. I don't even have to be number 10. I can just go and do gymnastics for fun. And I think that will help me keep moving forward in my life. How's it good? All right. All right. All right. Look at this. All three right. for three. Uh, you don't you. get any better, babe. Okay, okay. What did you learn about success today? Well, I was able to laugh at myself. It's a huge success. It is. is it? Tell me where you took a risk today. Going up to people and asking them what they thought of my pizza. Because <laughs> some of them said stuff. They were like, well, I like mine um, crisp or crispier and things like that. And then I was like, <laughs> I was like, mm. <laughs> okay, so what'd but, you do? Well, I was like, oh, okay, that's, that's great, you know, and the next time I'll know to make crispier pizza. Why do you think I gave you this assignment? Well, what I learned from it was definitely that when I, next time I do try something, I can come out of it finding the successes out of it and able to keep going. You've been trained to think of success as the Olympic gold. Right. And what I'm saying is that if you focus on the little successes, 
What do you think could happen? I think it would relieve a lot of that stress of feeling like I haven't gotten there yet when in reality, not only can I find successes in a little stuff that I've done, but I already really have been <laughs> way more than what other people have done anyway. So successes doesn't mean that you're perfect. Mm -hmm. Successes mean that you're caring about yourself, that you're loving yourself, that you're giving yourself credit mm -hmm. for your effort. Vanessa's next step is about taking risks. And that means she's going to be doing a lot of scary stuff. So can she keep this definition of success alive? Can she acknowledge herself? Or will Vanessa fall back and beat herself up one more time? I'm very excited. Me too.